Hi there, my name is Vince from mrtelephone.co.uk and this video is going to be a very quick version of how to wire up the NTE5C. If you want the detailed longer version, please see my other video which is much longer. So this is the socket here. To take off the front plate, you just slide this one out and then this is your back plate. This video is purely going to be how to connect up the back of this. So this is assuming you've only got one socket in the house. Now the network wiring, so the wiring from outside, needs to terminate on this red terminal at the back, which is marked up A and B. Okay, and so what you need to do is you need to put the wiring that comes from the street onto these terminals at the back here. And that's really easy to do, you don't even need any tools. All you need to do is lift this bit up here, you put your wires in, and then you snap it shut, so it's really simple. Now the colours you use will depend on the cable that you're using. So if you're replacing an older NT5 socket, you will just copy whatever's on the A and B onto this A and B. So that's nice and straightforward. If it's new work, then again, it depends on the colour of the, uh, the cable. So in this video, I'm using drop wire cable. So white's gonna go to A and orange to B. If you're using Cat5e cable, it would be white blue to A blue to B. If you're using CW1308 cable, it again would be white blue to A and blue to B. And if you're using this two pair cable here, then it would be orange to A and blue to B. So to connect them up really simple, you just lift that bit up there and then you want to make sure the wires go in nice and straight because there's two holes it needs to push through. So I'm just going to push them through both holes. So if you have a look closely there, not only has it gone through the first hole, there's also a second hole in the back. So you need to push them in until they can't go in anymore. And then all you do is snap that lid shut, and then that's made the connection. It's as simple as that. So then in your back box, you make sure that when you put the front plate on, that the wires don't get trapped in either of the screw holes here. So when you're putting it on, make sure that all the wires are well away from those screw holes. You can just give a little check, just like that. And then you put your two screws in. And then you just clip on the front plate. And that's how you wire up an NT5C. Okay, hope you enjoyed the video. Take care.